Okay, home from work. I already got the back open. Gonna add some Rockford Fosgate fuses. Take those other ones out of there. Stick with one brand. And uh, pre-wire up these back batteries. Like, these go in last, but it would be nice to get the wires going and just unhook them and tape them off, so I'm gonna worry about it later. There's eight of the 30 more wires that is gonna be hooked up back here. I said 15 in the last video, but I forgot that's 15 positives and 15 negatives. So I have 30 more of these to go. That's gonna be fun. So I don't even gotta tell you what I gotta do next. You saw what I did to the last ones, and I get to do it all over again, but this time there's more. On the reel, four batteries equals 16 lugs. So this is going to take a little while. All the batteries are all wired up, finally. Got that Rockford 2 watt cable. That's double zero. That's not 2 gauge. You know, it's the big stuff. So you guess this battery bank in the back comes out. And then the boss goes in, then the battery bank goes back in behind that. But it was important that the wires get cut to length and soldered up. So now all I gotta do is unhook them, tape them off, and hang them over. Now I'll have to worry about it later. So I'm glad that's over. So in case you didn't see the video right before this one, there's five batteries just like that buried underneath the car. So there's nine in the back right now and they're all hooked up, one up front. So I'm officially rolling on 10 batteries. Woo! Hell yeah. About 5,000 pounds of wire. <laughs>